On the twelfth day of Fresnes, my fan base gave to me. Deep breath. Twelve cascading windows, eleven spooky skellies, ten honking assholes, nine mighty morphers, eight darling space girl, seven time stop thrown, now six pirate treasures, five devil girls. Four twenty-eights, three hoverboards, two mavericks, and a monstrous hugs and kisses soiree. Hello, sweethearts and lovelies, and welcome to Fresmus X, day 12, the finale. We hit everything into this one tune, all 12 games, and here we are, at last, the end of it all. As requested by lovely friend of the show, Astro Stella, Kingsway. Kingsway. Swa I thought soiree was pronounced like soiree. Could be. Uh -huh. So Kingsway is a roguelike. It's got an interesting aesthetic, I think. So we're just gonna... I haven't done any rounds. I just made this guy the test it out. So let's make a new adventure. Okay. What kind of portraits we have here? I, oh, okay. Okay, we can really... Uh, let's hit randomize a bit. Let's see. Oh, this guy looks funny. What a strange person. Okay, not bad. Very distressed. That's a big mood. This, 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 is it just me? For the Doctor Who fans here, does this kind of look like Sasha Dewan, the current master of Doctor Who? It kind of does. It, it kind of does, <laughs> doesn't it? I think I think we're gonna go with this guy, and we're gonna name him Master, just because. I want, I want to have a little fun with it. He, just, he needs a bit more scruffy facial hair, but he's basically... So do we have any... We don't have any facial hair here. No. Custom? Oh, you could have... Oh, you could have a custom uh, avatar. Okay. Class, adventurer, warrior, mage, roger, beastkin, adventurer. Well-rounded. Not great. Not bad on anything. Strong character, skills, heavy weapons, and armor. Wise character, folks, with magic. Agile character, master many battle skills for beats. Can odd character, strong and tough, but has a bad reputation. Let's just go with an adventurer. Uh, okay, we can see the stat array. Mm, what kind of agility would I have? Low agility. Let's, let's roll with a let's roll with a warrior. So because steam sucks eggs, you weren't able to sell all your skiff steam gifts tonight. This dimension sent out three of them. Oh, that's nice, Rainiac. I was doing a few last night and it was really annoying me, but mm. so. Choose a starting gift, six health points, two magic, twenty gold. Let's go with the, let's go with the health. And th this just takes me right the fuck back. <laughs> like look at this. <laughs> it's fucking this is Windows 95 as fuck, for some reason. Uh quests, volume, speed, paused. So I have no idea what's happening here. There's our status. There's our log. Quests. None. The world navigator. Master. My bag. Quests. Music. Ooh, it's like a little wind amp. I like this. Joan Jett has entered the chat. Double click world, open the map. Yeah, I figured that was what we were doing. Oh, there we are! Oh Jesus, we've got we've got like we've got a fake ass clippy. The yellow circles on the map are map notes. Click a node to travel to its location and inspect it for more information. Training room, distance 112, location boat. Travel. Oh man. This is kind of cute actually. There's a battle dummy. Some locations of event that trigger. When you arrive, you must deal with the event before you can continue traveling. Attack. 
In battle, choose a skill. Each skill is best for use in summer faster than others. Plus, this attack skill is like your target. Oh, there's like, okay, there's a loading bar for your cooldown. Or is that his, or is that the dummy's turn? Yeah. Okay, so agility is loading bars. That's cute. Loot. Nothing. We can continue. You will counter battles traveling as well as managing. You got any too powerful, you can try to escape. Okay. There's treasure. This is so cute. I like the aesthetic. There's a sign next to the chest that reads one free potion per adventure. Double click my bag to move here your items. Click and drag to move items between bags back then once and take what you need. Okay, so we we literally just like copy files here. Yeah, minimize that. Okay. Oops, I meant to hit travel. I, I I gotta admit, the aesthetic of this is really neat. And it's hitting a lot of nostalgia for me. Return to surface. Okay, what's what's this? This is the King's Land. The King's Castle City is ca careful traveling east too quickly. Powerful monsters closer to the King Castle take your time to get experience on the way, so we want to go down here. I got a quest. Double click the quest icon. Orientation. Welcome to Kingsway. We here at Adventure Corps are here to guide you in your pilgrimage to the King's Castle. First thing you want to do is get acquainted with the guild. The guild is an organization that employs outsiders like yourself to do various tasks around the land. The rewards will be sent to you to join. Bring them the letter that brought you here, and they'll take it from there. You can find guild outposts in any fort. King Summon rewards supplies bag. Do I have? Oh, I have King Summon. Ooh. <clears throat> the old story. The old tell stories of the shifting land where one day the sun won't shine, rise, but instead an eternal being will travel over the land. Closing the sky with unsinkable size, its footprints distort the ground. Those few survive and only recognize the land. The history will begin anew. Every era, mm. the people of the land seek a savior in the cycle of destruction, bound to the eternal one. Which some call the Sky Eater. Ancient prophecy predicts an outsider will come to the King's Land only days before the Reckoning and gain the power to destroy the Sky Eater. Travel to the King's Castle of the East. Prove yourself over the Savior of the Land. I've also got a key, so let's uh, let's head down here. Just just get some hit up all the towns and dungeons you can. All right, let's uh, let's, let's hit this shit up and see what we got. There's a hood figure in a path sitting on a rock. I'm scared. Let's approach and say hi. The hood figure appears to be injured and asks for your health. Give a potion. Yeah, let's do it. The hood figure gains strength and thanks you. Talk. The hood figure thanks you again and gives you a treasure. I got a pointy hat! Talk advice! Some monsters only come out at night. Okay. Let me... Where's my... Where's my shit? Properties. Plus six lifesteal. Need to be level three, though. Okay, so that's that'll be fun for later. Oop. There we go. I got that Zambi. No loot. Uh, nothing happened. I guess it was just that fight. Oop. Hit that button. Oh shit. Two damage. Dang. Ooh, a farm hat. Fence one, wait one location, my bag. Let's uh let's pop that let's pop that hat on for now. Some of these outposts have nothing, some of them are friends, some of enemies, some have loot. Okay. So you just wanna hit up everything to explore and ooh, ooh, ooh. That looks powerful. I'm at I wanna leave. Uh oh. Uh oh. Okay, yeah. That look, that looked a little strong. I didn't like that. 
Oh, no, oh, I've got like 29 health. I, I might be fine. The select few have fountains you can heal at. Okay. I might be fine for a little leveling. I might be. I don't know. Oh, skeletons in your area. Hmm. The Church of the Ascending has been raising the dead from their own grave areas to protect themselves from the many threats of the land in these trying days. Unfortunately, the enemies of the Church often lose control of the Iron Earth. Don't clean up their mess. Bring us some skulls intact and we can give them a proper burial. Requirement for skulls. Okay. So... Uh oh. You do want to keep moving. Okay. Gotcha. Okay, I can just do like that. You see that shadow? Oh, okay, I'm on the timer. Oh, there's a skeleton. He's gonna hit me. Oh, I level up! Choose new skill. Bolster. Next attack does double damage. Stun. Grim aura. Poison enemies for two when they attack you. Critical focus. Transcritical hit up. At the start of every battle, your first attack is 40% faster. I like this one. Okay. Ruined armor and a skull. I like the skeleton sprite. Oh, shit. Can I deal with this? It's also bouncing around like crazy. Okay, I got it. I got a beast eye for my troubles. This is... This is neat enough. Alright, I can level up my shit, so... I'm gonna level up my agility, just because I'm a little fast. Oh, how many points do I have? In, how many points do I have in this? Oh, three. And we'll put one in... Yeah, we'll, we'll put we'll put them all in agility. Just, just for now. <laughs> that seems... Seems okay. Windows move a bit. Ruined armor, defense three. What is my encumbrance at, though? Plus two travel distance. That seems pretty good. Certain attacks spawn in their own window, so you need to be able to tab back and forth quickly. <laughs> that sounds pretty fun. All right, let's uh, let's let's head let's head up here now, just to see. Now that we're level two, encumbrance isn't a thing. Okay, that's good. That's a bit of a relief. Nothing. Okay. Let's head, let's head in here. Find more bags for extra storage. Oop, there's an Ascendant. Got it. Critical hit. Another one. Get in the, oh, I didn't get in now. I'm blocked fast enough. There we go. That'll find that works. Nothing. Okay. Damn, there sure are a lot of enemies on this path. Ooh, another key. Bunch of shit. Uh. Properties. I don't need level three. Hmm. Magic, eh? Ooh, pretty.
Okay, so I can do some supply bullshit like this. Alright. <clears throat> ah, storage, okay. I'm gonna put my beast eyes skull. And I'll put that shirt in here too, because why not? You need nine strength, I see. Doom Spear or Frenzy? Minus 13 damage to demons, plus two critical chance. Crab is only nine. Dagger? Damage one to one. Don't really need that. Spear? Damage three to four. Required is only nine and required level three. Keep your bag separate. Yeah. Oh, wait. You can, like. Oh, I can do it like that. Okay. Okay. I see what you mean. Okay, don't nest them, yeah. So you can have them up in windows. I got, I got, I got you. How much gold do I have? Forty-eight. Mm, I don't need to heal yet. Having bags specifically for potions is a good way to uh, speed up item uses. And speaking of potions, potion of attack. Temporarily increase attack speed. Don't drink more than three a day. Mm. Nothing I really want. Plus three percent magic on the find. Travel shirt. Defense two plus one travel distance. Versus defense three. Nah. Also, we can change the music. Time passes quickly and sh Oh yeah, you don't sleep because the shadow catches up. Okay. Okay. So there's a town here. Oh, I wanna hit- I wanna hit up with some of these little places, too. Check the magic item shop. Those rings could be good. Yeah. Another wanderer in the distance. A curious approach. Wanderer's willing some treasure. Does another shield. Let's talk. Let's buy it. Ooh. Spooky. The Corrupt Leather Garb of Stone. Minus one regeneration, plus 8% damage protection. Talk rumors. Have you heard of the Foundation? They stay in the mountains summoning demons, but why? Demons are so dangerous, they must be playing something. Mike, I see you there. You're, go you're gonna freak out. Item rosters and shops will re-randomize each time you visit a fort or town. Let's, let's, hit, let's hit up this town. Let's see? Okay. I must say. Potion shop, okay. That to your right there across the water is a dungeon. You should visit it. Time passes more so this is a good way to get levels in, okay. Defense 4 and plus 1 travel distance. That's actually pretty good. What's the robe like, though? Defense 2 and magic power. Okay, yeah, I want... I want... Okay. Wait, I got a ring. When did I get that? Someone made this game out of love for old windows and roguelikes. <laughs> well, you can drop items here to sell them. Oh, but I put them all in the uh, thing.
Question is, where does the shit I bought, bought went go to? Okay, there we go. Gotta go like that. Okay. See if I can sell that shit to the armor shop. Is this any good? I like minus one regeneration. I'll just, I'll just keep it around for now. So that thing's a dungeon. Quest. What? I thought I hit attack. I swear I thought I hit attack. Oh, I leveled up. Let's uh, hang on here. Okay, get 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 this shit out of my way here for a second, please. All right, we, we're, we're paused. The king's castle. Hello, master. Making your way to the king's castle won't be an easy task. There are three beacons. The first might be lit before the king's gate will open. You can spread it across the island and protect the king's power for nights. Help you find a way to put a map on the of the island in your storage box at the guild. Go down the guild up. It's picked up. And are you strong enough? There are reports a large group of skeletons in your area. Members who come to someone in the desert area. You're starting to come prepared. Location has been added to the world navigator. Kill the skeleton at location. Okay. Let's wait. Okay. Yeah, I know. Stat points. Something good to remember. Every level up fully heals you. Okay. I like critical focus. I kind of like just building. Okay. my strength, one to vitality, and one to agility. It sounds good. That thing doesn't look like a dungeon. Guild quests are very worth it to do. Hmm. Pavin is, yeah, the dungeon. Okay, yeah. Oop, there's a skeleton. things considered. Oh, we got a slime. K. 
Come on, master, get him. What? Oh, fuck. Oh, now we're really into it. I see what they're doing. <laughs> Now you gotta multitask. I see what this shit is. Let's head into the dungeon. My name's Laura. <laughs> God. Priest. Ooh. Oh, I don't like this. I'm a, yeah, I'm out of that. That looks a little too strong for me. Actually, all of this looks a little too strong for me. Avoid. <laughs> Ooh, seven damage. Damn, yeah, this is a... This is a bit much for my, uh... I'm gonna press on. Just to see. Should be able to handle it, but... There we go. Doomed Orb of Intellect. And the Skull. Let's just minimize this. Oh, yeah, eight. There we go. 20 health. That might be. If you want to go outside for easier guys, watch your health. Let's... let's... Whoa! Well, let's get the treasure, at least. Is being guarded by a creature? No. <laughs> sure you can see your status. Yeah. Let's, uh... Let's do this. Phantom. Nothing. Okay. Yeah, that looks like a little bit much. It's a good grinding spot, but I'm not quite leveled up enough for it yet. But I have an idea. <laughs> I can take the Phantom, I think. Maybe I can't take the Phantom. Yeah, I know my health is critically low. Did you just minimize my shit? Master the Wanderer, level 3 warrior, killed by phantom. Day 0 out of 616. Gems are in 3. Press ESC to reset. Drink potion. Huh? Select an adventurer to begin. a uh, shop. Let's see what we got in the shop. 3 gems. Just can't do much. Appearance! Oh, that's cute. Hotkeys. Ooh. <laughs> Those are neat. This adventurer's dead. Do you want to bury them? No. Oh, let's roll again. Let's see. This fe this this fella kind of looks like he belongs in Zelda Wind Waker. Having your potion bag open to battles can help. Yeah, probably. Uh, this guy. And there's this fella. And there's this person. I like this I like this mustache. This fella. This person. This person, this person, this person. I do want to bury them. Uh, let's go back and do that. Oh, choose a memento. The travel robe. <laughs> this 
Okay. I I'm picking this person. I'm naming them. Grant Morrison. <laughs> or Grant Morris. Because it's Grant Morrison. It's Grant Morrison. Hmm. I liked Warrior. Well, let's go with Rogue this time. This could be fun. Okay, we can pick. The, we can pick to start with this shit. Try B skin. Oh, I already picked the character, but Vegetable orientation. Blah 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 blah. blah. Yeah, we we did this shit. Okay, click the com button and it says it's using more. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I read it. I read it. You can. This can go away now. They can eat garbage. Also try boosting strength. Okay. Strength is generally recommended as the most recommended stat. Okay, that's good. That's good. That's good. Okay. So here's Grant Morris. Ori is great, but he did, clearly didn't possess that's destructivity that turn. Okay, so. All right. Okay, so the world the world is all randomly generated too. That's that's neat. Uh huh. Give a potion. Talk. Ooh, a great treasure. Let's go check that shit out. Ooh, look at all this shit. Look out, kids. I've got a board with a nail in it. <laughs> Properties need to be level two. Way crystal. Crush this to get outside quickly. Do not eat. Okay. And the corrupt cleaver of doom. Level five. Ooh. Can't use this item yet. What do I need to be? What level do I need to be for this shit? Need to be level two. So we're just gonna put the. Uh, Status bar over here. I gather figuring out like just exactly how to uh, efficiently win deal with your windows is good too in this game. Ooh, let's drop one gold. Make a wish. Okay, there's a healing fountain. That's that could be helpful. Skellington. Damn. Three damage. Oh, I got the Skellington. That's nice. Alas, poor Yorick. Like escape ropes and Pokemon. Yeah, yeah, that's, that's what they're like. Okay. Let's go back to the healing fountain. The healing fountains have a secret purpose. Oh shit. Which I guess we'll find out pretty soon. Pump club. Gold dropped in them is carried over between runs. Oh, that's nice. That's very helpful. Oh, the healing well's empty. Oh shit. <laughs> That's nice. It's nice that there's these all these little systems to uh, build up your. What am, what am I looking for? Uh, what's the word I'm looking for to describe this? Continuity between runs. Mighty broken sword of frenzy. Ooh. What is that? Zero to one plus one strength plus one critical chance. Hmm. What do I have now? It's, it's a strict upgrade, so let's, uh, let's pop it on.
monolith down there. I also want to visit them when you can. Offer an enchanted item and I'll give you a skill point. That's not bad. Skeletons in my area. Yeah. Poor skulls. Yeah. So. So I'm down here. Oh shit. I know how this goes. Actually. No. I don't think I want to deal with it. <laughs> Who figure says he was selling a mysterious item? Ooh. That looks neat. Getting a good rest in the end of the game is don't waste too much time sleeping. Two. I'm gonna sell that. Hollow travels are minus 12 each. Hmm, yeah, that's gonna be pretty good. Card strength 10. Curve sword. Card strength 10. This is a bit much. Let's see. More spears, quark, agility 14. Okay. Hardy ring of stamina. Let's see if I tell any card level 4 scroll burn, wood one, and no potion of magic. I don't actually see much, but let's check out this monolith while we're here. Okay. We got another zombo. Jesus. I'm gonna be in trouble here. I'm blocking and it's still doing three damage. Jesus Christ. Let's go for a risky thing. Yes, thank you. Alright, choose new skill. Yes, yes, I know. I know, Clippy. Toxic tip, add three points to the next attack. Pick lock, open bandages. Ooh, recover 4% health after each battle. I like that. Two. We leveled up! <laughs> so I'm gonna try to run. Alright, Morris, we need to, uh... We need to equip you with some shit. Damage 1 to 2. Stat points available. Oh, stat points are available. Okay. Put him in the strength, like Stella said. Travel road, travel robe, and a nail club. Sounds neat. <laughs> you want to ask for something the models right now? I think would have to be your weapon. Okay. I can offer that sword, that, that, that dagger I just left behind, I guess. Make offering. Dun, dun, dun. What's with this helm? Oh, that's gonna be pretty good.
give offering. You feel more skill, plus one skill point. That's not bad. At the start of every battle, your first attack is 40% faster. I, I like that. I like that skill. Okay. Let's also put on this helmet. I'm gonna head back up because the monsters down here are just a little too strong for me right now, I feel. Throwing axes. Okay, okay, okay. I, I, I know how this shit works. Crab Agility 14. Should attack Curved Sword, Curved Sword, Curved Sword. Deft Ring of Flight. Plus 3 Agility. Ooh, that's, ooh, that's pretty good. What, do I, what what Agility do I need for that? Well, I need to be level 4, but... I don't even have enough gold for it, anyway. Hi, Gash. Oh, shit. You got the skelling. This is something new made to be retro. Yeah. Okay. Is a roguelike made to look like Windows 95 with menus and shit? So, okay, we're not dealing with that shit, if I can help it. <laughs> I might be able to take this, it's still only got 11 HP. back up. I like the shield. So we can be pretty defensive. Ascended. Free potion. Yeah, not bad. Oh, and a level up. How about that shit? The start of everybody first two attacks are forty percent faster. Hmm. Don't forget to turn in the guild quest for that supply bag, yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna upgrade vigilance just just because it seems like a good idea. And I'll put mm, one point into agility, just for fun. Yeah, okay, the beacon thing, yep. Yeah. Okay. Don't forget to turn in the guild quest for that supply bag. Hurry, limited time offer. Give out free potions. Limit one per adventurer. Okay. Let's see if we can't go back and get a free potion. Well, that dark shit approaching is pretty scary. Skellington? Ooh, we're doing lots of damage now. Actually, while I'm here... I don't really use magic power, so I'm gonna put on this. Free potion will make you wait in the line and take up time. May not want that. Well, I'm already heading there, so... Oops. <laughs> nah. 
Let's wait in line. Let's just see. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> All this for a potion. <laughs> well, if it kills me, it kills me. Full health potion. If it catches up, the game gets much harder. Okay. See, I thought it was just going to be instant death. <laughs> wow, one hit. <laughs> That was exciting. I don't think we're gonna make it. <laughs> Did get a skull though. How many do we have? One, two, three. We're just gonna go directly this way. Okay, I'm buried. Abandoned hovel, let's enter. There are several rooms. Where do you go? A uh, bedroom. Paper with strange symbols. The monolith research paper. Oop, there's a monster in here. Ooh, more potions. I'll need that bag pretty soon, but we can get that at the uh, guild here. <laughs> Robe plus one. Hmm. All right. Now we can put around potion. We'll put another potion in there. Put our full potion in there. Crescent potion. Invisible potion. Yeah. Yeah. Bright ring of judgment. Okay, we don't have... Okay, there we go. Might as well put that on. Yeah. Drink the Crescent Potion. It's plus one stat. Okay. Use that to boost strength, I guess. Plus one defense, plus 13 magic power. I don't think that's actually... Is it? Defense two. No, it's not as good as what I've got right now. Okay. Damage two to three, but required to only nine. Cleaver. Card level four. Spear, Crab Agility 9. One more skull needed for that, s that quest, yeah. I don't know if 
I find another skeleton, I'll come back to it. Enter the deserted home? Okay, let's look around. Hmm. This is where the potion will go in the supplies. Oh, come on. Give me what I need. Give me the skull. Yeah! Exactly what I needed. I'll just head back here. Okay, well, that's another skeleton, but. Doesn't matter. Key's always useful, though. I don't think I need another skull, all things considered. Attack damage will time to escape. Quickly inflict minimum damage to target. Mm. Okay. I was gonna go all in. Uh, I'm gonna go all in on vigilance. <laughs> Ooh, I. Oh shit. Yeah, I just went all in on vigilance for sure. Quest reward, travel ring, absorbance, something or other. Skill points. Put one in the vitality just for just for kicks. Minus one regeneration plus twenty one damage to beast. Damage two two versus one to two. Let's put on the corrupt cleaver. If I up agility now, I could get that spear. Yeah, well, I mm, I read that a little late, so... Oops. <laughs> Let's hit up this dungeon, see if we're strong enough now. I'm going for this jelly. I still have skill points? Oh, so I do. Okay. Let's add, let's add my agility up then, just for kicks. go back for that spear. I, I think we can beat the... Uh, why did my skill thing jiggle? No, oh, I'm buried. Plain ass dagger. Okay. Yeah, we can make it. Shit, this is like the way to go with this vigilance. This this is the way to go. You just you just DPS all your problems away. Let's see, damage three to four. Oh, that's much better. Limp acts of haunting, damage two two to four. Slow attack speed, cleaver, short sword, damage two two two. I like the spear. Cleaver. I don't think I want the robe. Sell the dagger. Sell the original travel road. Traveler's ring. What is this? Plus two regeneration, plus three move sleep, plus five travel distance. 
versus plus one intellect and plus 14 damage to demons. Yeah, I, I like this, but oh wait, I can just wear both. Hm. It works. Potion shop. I've got plenty of potions still. Mighty ring. Plus one strength. Huh. Death ring of flight. Plus one agility. I have two ring slots, yeah. Okay, let's head back to that uh, dungeon. Go wreck that dungeon bed. See if I can do my best with it. Oh, potion. So, oh, it's a magic potion. Okay. <clears throat> Nothing. Okay. Head on in. See if we can handle the dungeon now. Made it through the first node, fine. All right, the priest. Two damage. Doing a lot better damage than your last character was, yeah. This is ironic, considering I'm a rogue. <laughs> <laughs> I guess I'm doing more DPS of a build is the thing. Ooh, we got a fork in the road. Skeleton mage, huh? Can I make it? Yeah! <laughs> orb do plus one damage intellect okay so it's it's a mage weapon I guess priest or something who's gonna block yeah got another one to block defeated silver staff three to four damage skill fireball two hmm, neat that's another. So there's a lot of mage weapons in this dungeon here. Whoop! <laughs> the closer look you've seen the strange figures. Let's talk to it. I'll look you look at my eyes. You promise not to hurt me. Okay. Bag of items. Ooh, pretty, pretty stuff. How much gold do you have, Grant? Oh, you're one off from affording all this shit. Eh. Fuck. That's the boss. I don't want to take the boss yet. <laughs> this guy is great. Yeah. Got the church guard. Kite shield. Ooh, that could be good. Plus 15 block. Strength 8. Definitely. Equipping that. Playing again with Windows 98. We sure are. Whoop. Now I have the money. Oh, now I have the money. Oh, he's still there? Okay. If he's still there, I'll just talk to the fella and uh, do the thing. And he's not he's not there anymore. Huh, damn. Let's keep going. All right, the phantom, that's killed me last time. Gotcha. Plus percent block means your blocking actions are faster. Okay, that, well, that's good for me. Because, you know, I, I like hitting block and getting through quick. Like this! <laughs> oh, that's, re that's a really good shield, then. Okay. Void. I'm gonna 
didn't hear that. I took some damage there. Didn't get it fast enough. I got, I'm gonna take this one too, probably. Oh, there we go. Alright. Alright, that's fine. Oh, the phantom. <clears throat> got it. Well, I am getting lots of experience up here. Ooh, that looks that looks spooky. Oh, check that bad boy out. Ooh, one shotted. Beautiful. Treasure. Okay. Approach. Unlock. Book of poison. An antidote. And an oak staff. All mage shit. <laughs> It's gonna be an altar you can sacrifice health at. You wanna do that, especially since you have a full potion to recover. Okay. Oh, a priest. Ooh, he healed himself. Oh. That's clever. Got him, though. Okay, I got another supplies bag. It's too full to fit. Wake. Oh, the supplies bag. Oh, I hit that. I hit the wrong thing. Okay. Another phantom. Spirit mask. Defense five plus fifteen damage to humans. What have I got in my head now? Oh, defense three. Oh, this is a this is a clear improvement. Just a spear and a robe. Hmm. Also, I'm also next battle. I'm leveling up. That's nice. I'm actually going to pick the pick lock skill just because we're getting a lot of treasure chests. And we're gonna go to level up my stats. Build up that strength, I guess. <laughs> I've got the vigilance, so I'm like one shotting and I'm going fast. Gonna be out of room soon while well, I can drop a bunch of shit. If need be here. Okay, vigilance and bandage is like ridiculous. Bag too full to fill silver staff. Okay. What can I get rid of? I'll get rid of the shield. Like, Vigilance and Bandage is, like, too good a combo, because I, like... Even if I get hit once, I, like, heal it back, and I attack so fast... Oh, I hit block by mistake. <laughs> Oops. Gonna have to hit it a second time here, though. Maybe I'll use the book. Check its properties. We'll do... Here we go. Mage robe. Permanently learn skill poison. Don't have enough intellect. Hmm. Defense 3 plus 20 magic power. Versus. Defense 4. No, 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 no. I don't think I need the skull.
Let's teach you associate skills as long as you have enough intellect. Huh. I'm not really trying for magic this run. I'm just going pure, like, speedy physical shit. Oh, he healed instead. Got him. Two derbies on another poison. <laughs> Dungeon's real a really great like leveling spot, <laughs> not gonna lie. Oh, there's the phantom. Dealt with that shit. Some books will be things for passive skills like sword mastery or axe mastery, etc. That's neat. Is this on consoles? Probably not, considering the uh, heavy mouse use. Don't need that skull. <laughs> oh, another skeleton mage. Psychic blocking gum steak. Got hit for it. No, that's okay. Scroll of burn. Cast skill burn. I'll take it, just because. Could be it could come in. Yeah, you never know. Oh, there's the altar that you were talking about, Stella. Make sacrifice. Sacrifice twenty-four health. M plus one stat point. <laughs> sacrifice twelve health. Plus one stat point. Sacrifice six health. Plus one stat point. Sacrifice three health. Oh, fuck. There we go. Whew. That was almost a disaster. Heal, yeah. Lots of stuff. Strange rubble. Someone may want this. Okay. Here you go to my beast eye. Get rid of this robe. Here's this oak staff. And this helmet. For buckler. Strange rubble. Long sword. Oh. Too full of it, longsword. Okay, we got some skill points. I'll stop too greedy there and fell for a beginner's trap. I, I argue I did fall for the beginner's trap. There we go. Bag is too full to fit longsword. I love about beast skins that you can consume items to get your health back. That's nice. I guess too full. Okay, let's drop a staff then. Damage three to four. Versus three to four. Eh, it's the same shit. Hmm? I'm liking the rogue strat though. This is this is working for me. Same shit, but the sword weighs more. And a spirit mask. I don't need that. All right, let's see if we can take on the boss.
Don't need those mage robes. Let's see what we got here. High Priest. Two damage. <laughs> Ooh. Getting fancy. I see. Take a key. <laughs> I know you can win. All right. Bell of the Dead. More battle experience, but attracts undead. Hmm. Feather of Transform. A Feather of the Sky Eater. Hmm. Orb, plus eight damage. Bane Handle. Plus five agility, plus five intellect, skill, sneak attack, card level eight. Ooh, I like it. Yeah, you know that that sword, that sword can fuck off. I'm taking that main handle. I'm even get another treasure. Oh my god! Ooh, crescent potion. Supplies bag is too full to pit, pit crushing pumps. No, I'm gonna use it immediately. Deft orb of warding. Mm -hmm. Crude nail club of frenzy. Mm, no good. Slippers. Defense two. I'll put on the slippers. Travel shirt. Bright Nail Club. No. Crude Nail Club. No, okay. Can't take the Crude Nail Club. Hmm. Too full of its spear. I want to use that feather. Okay. Feel faintly connected to the cosmos. I can just walk out of here. <laughs> Deft orb is worth holding on to to give to a monolith, maybe. Okay. I want to get back to a town and uh, try and sell my loot. You are now in Katamari. Priest mask. Defense four and plus ten damage to bosses. Oh, that's defense five. So this is this is actually less good than what we've got right now. You feel the cosmos. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> Robe of Agility. Minus 7 attack speed. No, I'm not taking that. Can I even take it? No? Then fuck it. <laughs> Scroll of Heal. Ooh, that sounds nice. We'll take that. You know, that could be that could be handy. You can put the bell on your top left slot in your character. Yeah, that could help. Let's, uh, let's roll with that. That bell that gives you more experience, but more undead come after you. Yeah. Oh, look at that! Don't even need it. Level up. 
Permanently increase the chance to escape final blow. If the enemy has less than 16 health, kill them! <laughs> Actually, I'm gonna upgrade bandage, just because... This is, this is, this is the fucking way here, let me tell you. Oops. Roll navigator, come back to me. Full potion of magic, huh? Toss out. I'll just use potion of magic and take the full potion of magic because I'm not even using magic. Sneak attack can be good. It's very fast. Oh, stat points are available. And I'm currently doing nothing with my MP. Cruel ruined armor of vitality. No, no, don't need it. Okay, I got points. that strength just all right let's head to this town and sell off all my shit Five gold. I didn't actually sell that. Probably time to get moving too. The shadows upon you. Huh. Sell the crude nail club. I want the bane handler though. Mm -hmm. Defense six and plus twelve block versus. Yeah, that's no good. Mm -hmm. Keep the deft orb if I come to cross another monolith. Yeah, we can change the music. I forgot we could do that. Anyway, small shield key, smoke bomb, and potion. There's nothing else here that we really want to fiddle with, so let's 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 make some progress. You can sell all keys since you got a lockpick skill. Oh yeah, I forgot about that. Potion of magic, I don't think I need that. Who did figure greets you? What do you really like to discuss? Advice! Dangerous to travel east too quickly. The monsters and bandits are stronger near the king's castle. Hmm. On the other hand, I do need to make some progress. You won't believe this potion! Hello, Grant Morris! I hear you might be interested in unique product made specifically for adventures like yourself. You won't know this potion anywhere else. I ask you to gather the core ingredient. Three living seeds. Okay. Whatever that is. There's a beacon ahead. Oh, that gray thing, I guess. It's that circular platform. Okay. <laughs> Who figures being attacked is losing? Help! Oh, yeah, let's help out. Let's, let's deal with this shit. Light the beacons. Oh, okay. 
Here's a figure thanks you again gives you 25 gold. Nice. Just traveling to regenerate my magic energy. Let's check out the beacon. <laughs> Each beacon also carries a boss. Group of thieves. Let's say hi. There are three of them. Strength! Intimidate! The thieves are not scared of you. <laughs> Okay, we got one. They're a little more agile. They're not, like, bad. Hollow Ring of Vitality. Minus 10 magic power, plus 4 vitality. Deft Ring of Strength. Deft Thief Garb of Health, and I don't need a key, so. Search Treasure, Book of Wand Mastery, Grim Shield of Vitality. So let's check out this shit. Do more damage with wands. Eh. Use it. Grim Shield of Vitality. Defense 4. Not really good. Death Thief's Garb of Hell. Defense 5. Plus 2 agility, plus 3 regeneration, plus 12 escape chance. Hmm, that's not bad. I just think I want that. Check out this beacon. Why not? Let's see. Read warning. Light the three beacons to open the can. The can is guarded by Brock. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> I'm just going to have this up. Because <laughs> you never know. Okay. So far. There we go. Poisoned. That's not good. I hit that fucking button. I clicked that thing, you son of a bitch. I should kill him, though. Charm of Fortitude. King's Icon. Brot's Helm. Leather Armor plus one. Oh. Too full. There we go. Thank you. 
Defense 10. Ooh, I like this. I like this helmet a lot. Learn skill bandage. That's a... That's definitely a thing we have. Defense 8 plus 1 defense. Oh, actually, we just put this on. It was, oh, that was defense 5 and regeneration. Let's put it on. Actually, uh, Stella, is there a way to, like, save your run and come back to it? Because we, we're, we're on time here now. I'm, I'm having fun, but I got lots to do, but th this would be a nice little spot to stop. If I can stop right around here. Player. Yeah, that's me. Log. Yeah. Information. Oh, you can get all this shit. System version. Oh. The game should auto save. Well, in that case, that's gonna do it for Fresmus X Day 12 and Fresmus in general. So let's uh, let's quit. Progress will be saved. Yes, there we go. Boop, 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 boop. There's Grant Morris, the level seven rogue. Oh, check that charm. It's good. I believe you. Uh, we already quit that, but <clears throat> that's it. It's Fresmus. Christmas X, the tenth one, has been completed. Over ten years we've played 120 games for streaming marathons. Can you believe that? Over a decade. Can you believe that? That's incredible. My God. Good conclusion to a good Christmas. Good stream. Yeah, it was really fun. So thank you, Stella, for Kingsway. A really fun little roguelike. Thank you all for showing up to this. And, uh, yeah. I don't have much else to say. Two days from now, it's Christmas. I hope you all have a very happy holiday. And, you know, I'll see you again sometime. Maybe not today, maybe not tomorrow. Well, you saw me today, but maybe not tomorrow, maybe not the next day, but... You'll probably see me again on here before uh, the next Fresmus. Because I didn't stream at all between Fresmus Cloud9 and Fresmus X, but I'll probably, I'll probably stream in 2021. I have some uh, expensive ideas, so <clears throat> that's all there is to say. Have a good one. Much love to you all for your support over the years. And... We'll see you whenever the next time is. Have a good holiday. Good night. Much love. Bye-bye.